um, the most embarrassing moment would have to be when my daughter needs to go to the toilet. I asked her if we need to go before we left the house. She was like, no. We got to the crib, she used the toilet. I asked her again before we left, she was like, no. We went to the park and then we was on the bus going home and she was like, mommy, I need to go to the toilet. And I'm like, um. We're like, I say, give or take 15 minutes away from the house, but there's nowhere to get off the bus to go to the toilet unless you're gonna go in like the bush and it's like if you might well just wait till you get to the top of the hill. I had to take my daughter's nappy and put it on her and then she was on the bus. She was like, I need to wee wee. I was like, it's okay, you can wee wee in the nappy. She's like, no, I've got to wee wee in the toilet. And then out of nowhere, she like starts to squat on the bus and she's holding up her skirt. And she's like, mommy, I'm wee wee on the bus. And I was like, shh, Mimi, you're not wee wee on the bus. You're wee wee in the nappy. You know, everyone's just looking like, is she really letting her child the wee on the bus? When I was breastfeeding, when Delilah was a few weeks old, I went to pull her off and I accidentally flashed like an 80-year-old man and he was <laughs> a bit scared. Um, but obviously that was completely accidental. We was on our way to Eastbourne to see my grandparents and Kaylin had a poo explosion on the train. And there was no toilets on this train. The train was packed and I had to literally put him on the chair and change him. It was literally everywhere. Like he was only a couple of months old and it was everywhere. People were staring at me like, oh, I've never felt so much shame in my life. No one really saw this because we was at home and this is when she was like still a newborn. So I was changing her nappy and she had like pooed up her back. So I was changing the nappy, obviously I didn't put a baby mat underneath me that she ended up putting on my trousers and then it stopped and then I tried to wipe her and then it started again. So I had to literally walk to the bathroom with my clothes on and get into the bathroom and wash myself. One day we woke up in the morning um, and my son, my son was like, oh daddy, you know last night when you were sleeping, you, you were fine. <laughs> <laughs> and I just laughed. I think that was embarrassing. <laughs> we was basically in Asda doing some shopping and um, he picked up a toy and I said, no, Zachary, you can't have that. And he was like, how dare you? And he said it so loud. It echoed through the whole store. I think it bounced off the wall four times. And everyone just stopped what they were doing and they were staring at me and I was like, and I couldn't be like, no, don't do that, because <laughs> everyone was watching. But like, that was so embarrassing. Like, I didn't know what to do.